Welcome to another start of another custom campaign, Malfurion's Quest, which is the final one in Tomo Raider's uh, God damn it, uh, campaign series. We haven't done the, the Scourge one yet, and we haven't finished Tides of War. But, as people know, I'm not the biggest fan of Tides of War, but I will get through with it. Also, peop uh, I don't remember the name of the creator of uh, The Legend of Ar Ar Arcanian. Oh god, I can't even say it. Uh, has pumped up the Orc and Undead campaigns. I really need to do some catching up uh, in this week, you know, something. I don't know. But uh, either way, we are going to at least start on Malfurion's quest. I don't know when I will upload this, but at, at this time, I have not finished Tides of War. I have not uh, con continued on the Legends of Arcanian, even though I should. Now, let's start with the Oracle's Prophecy. Oh. No inter uh, introduction scene, uh, no, not the text at all, in fact. And I like the wallpaper, really like it a lot. So it's going to be interesting to see how what's been happening now. In the time before time, the world of Azeroth consisted of one massive continent known as Kalimdor. The most successful of uh, successful inhabitants of this strange land were the Night Elves. At the center of their civilization lay the Lake of Incentivous Energies. This lake, known as the World of Eternity, served as the heart of the world's beauty and magic. For ages past, the Night Elves lived a life of great peace and prosperity. However, this life was not to last forever. Within the Night Elf Society were the Highborn who developed the ability to control the Well of Eternity's cosmetic energies. After becoming corrupt from absorbing the world's matter, the Highborn began to use their new powers for sinister purposes. Their reckless use of magic soon attracted the attention of a great demonic race known as the Burning Legion. Through manipulation, the Highborn were tricked into summoning portals which allowed the demons pa uh, passage into Azeroth from the Twisting Nether. And thus began the great war known as the War of the Ancients. Great cities fell to the demons as they uh, commenced their war on Azeroth. Through the brave Night Elves stood their ground, many fell to the fury of the Legion's onslaught. Eventually, a vice scholar named Furion Stormer discovered that the Vell of Eternity was the demon's link between the two worlds. Determined to end the Legion invasion, he rallied many great allies to aid him. Among them was the great demigod, Scenarius. His powers over nature allowed him to command the forest to do his bidding. Another faction were the powerful dragonflights, the guardians of the world. While they preferred not to interfere with the affairs of mortals, the Burning Legion threatened their duty of safeguarding all life.
Finally, there was Taranda Whisperwind, the future leader of the Night Elves. She is also Furion's beloved and a high priestess of Elun. United, Furion led his allies to attack the insane Heimborn and destroy the Well of Eternity. Yet, the Night Elves' victory over the Legion came at a heavy price. The Well's destruction resulted in a massive explosion that tore the world apart. Devastated from the catastrophic event and the loss of their homes, the Night Elves abandoned their use of magic in fear of another world sundering. Those who survived the explosion eventually made their way to the landmass in the site, Mount Hyjal. While the Night Elves had hoped to rebuild their civilization, a familiar presence awaited them nearby the lake. Illidan Stormrage, the brother of Furion, had defiled the waters of the lake with the energies from the destroyed well in his lust for power of ma magic. He ultimately created a new well of eternity. For his crimes, this now called Malfurion sentenced his brother to be imprisoned. The Night Elves' watchers, led by Maya of Shadowsong, were entrusted to ensure Illidan remained sealed in his chamber for all eternity. To safeguard the well and prevent the demons from returning to Astaroth, Malfurion and the Dragonflights made a pact. A great tree was to be implanted to grow over the well and protect its magi. This tree, named Nordrasil, would stand as a symbol of the Night Elves' bond to nature. The tree was also blessed to allow the Night Elves to never age or fell prey to disease. As all was well until Malfurion and the Night Elves were instructed to meet with the ancient oracle. Why is it you have summoned us, Ancient One? I have seen a dark future ahead of your people, Shandal Stormridge. Take heed to my words as I inform you of my prophecy. The demons seek to destroy Azeroth and wow to their last breath. In ten millennia's time and through mortal works, the Legion will, re will return to incur death. The Night Elves and Demons will battle once more, yet only one race will survive the dawn. Despite the Oracle's prophecy, Malfurion and the Druids were required to uphold their end of the pact of protecting the Well of Eternity. They agreed to allow their spirits to roam and uh, the infinite parts of Ysero's Emerald Dream, a spiritual world which exists, exists outside the boundaries of the physical world. Ensuring the flow of nature from the Emerald Dream required a druid to sleep for many centuries. The time has come, my love. Ysera has assured me I will, I will awaken should the Legion ever make their return. Please, Furion, you cannot leave me for Ysera's Emerald Dream. I need you with me. Do not worry, Taranda. No, as long as we hold true to our love, we will never be truly apart. 
Just remember, I will always be thinking about you. I... I understand. Ten thousand years later. Take position, sisters. The demons are coming. It is as foretold. The Legion is ready, my lord. The Nidals won't stand a chance. To arms, warriors! We are the protectors of Nordrasil, and we shall unite, shall stand united. Your courage will not save you, Storm Rage. Press the attack! Now, Furion! Taste the wrath of the goddess demons! Fight on, my warriors! Their forces are depleting! Nothing stands between me and the World Tree. Gods, help us. There's too many. Furion. My strength. You shall go no further, kill Jaden. Elune will give me strength. Taranda. How very bold, priestess. Unfortunately, your goddess will not save you this time. Power can you hope to defeat the demons? Or watch as the Legion destroys the world. 